All right, so we are going to personalize our survival ferro rod here. Uh, why would you need to do that to survive? You absolutely don't. I'm doing this because I'm giving it to my kids as a stocking stuffer, and uh, I want them to each have their own thing labeled so that they don't fight over it. Um, the way I'm going to go about this is using a wood burner pen. This is a, you know, basically a beginner wood burner pen. Um, the way you do this is you turn this on, you got to let it heat up for a few minutes. And once it's, once it's there, you can start just writing whatever. Um, I've got an extra piece of fat wood here, one that I could never use to, uh, to make. Um, one of the handles because it's way too thin. So we're just going to use that to see if this is hot enough. I've been letting it sit here for a few minutes and uh, usually you got to test it real quick. So let's just see what happens here. All right, so that's looking pretty good. It's making lines. Um, so really all you're going to do is you're going to go over to the, uh, the fatwood handle. You're going to find where you're going to put it. I'm going to put a letter right in the middle here. I'll put my, my son's initial um, so that he and his siblings don't battle it out over this stuff so we'll just start writing i'm going to write an m and I'm not really like a design guy here but basically you you make your you make your lines where you want them to go um you can see the smoke coming up and uh because i'm burning fat one here it actually smells really good like a a nice pine house um i'm just going to make a simple m right here in the middle you can see that's starting to take shape And we'll just go down here to finish this off. Super simple. Now we've taken our survival ferret rod and we've customized it a little bit. Um, you can see here I've just got a regular basic tip in there. Nothing special. It's just a, looks sort of like a flathead screwdriver on the side. Um, and you just press it in there and you can, you can make your mark. That's it. So very easy to, to customize these. Obviously, you know, if you're art inclined, you can go crazy and do a lot more than this, but I'm simply putting in uh, initials.